Awesome weekend. Seems to be a real spark about you in your eyes, the way you raced after the race as well. Looked like you really enjoyed the weekend. How positive is the, the vibe within you and the team right now? Yeah, I mean, it was a very good weekend for us, for me, for us. I mean, we would have liked to obviously score points with both cars, our home race, but I think we did well from where we came from on the grid. And for me in particular, with the experience I had on Sunday, so yeah, nothing to, nothing was wrong with, with that weekend. And um, we see what we get here. How important are the next few weekends going to be for you, given the, the upgrade package that's arrived in terms of understanding it, fine tuning it, and determining the direction of the rest of the season? The direction of the season? Yeah. Um, important. I mean, I think we did a step forward. I think that there were still some things that we need to correct um, and fine tune, which probably, hard to say now how big the impact will be, but they will probably help us to be more competitive. But we know ultimately we are not quick enough. We are lacking downforce compared to people in front, and it's hard to overcome that with you know one set of parts. Um, other people are not sleeping either, so um, yeah, it, it will very much depend on um, you know what uh, the next step brings to the car, because then we will see where where we are till the end of the year, and then at some point it's a compromise between this year and next year. You know, money is I don't want to say tight, but. Uh, <laughs> In terms of how much you would like to spend to develop the car, you need to be a bit, uh, bit more strategic than the last last years. McLaren have already said no big upgrades for them for the remainder of the season. For us, so there you go. They spend the money on next year. So the consideration is there a, a feeling with the team to already switch, or are you focused? Well, I think every team is looking into that. It's not as not a secret. I think there's a lot of stuff we've seen, a lot of stuff that everybody has learned. So, you know, you try and take that into next year, and based on that. It costs you more money or less. I mean, I don't know if Red Bull is going to change a lot on their car. Maybe not because their car is by far or by a little bit the best. Um, so they, maybe they, they don't have that much to change, whereas obviously we are further back. You could argue there's more potential to change, which also costs money. So we will see. I think uh, it will be interesting. Um, but yeah, I think you will not see huge packages arrive every race like it was in the past.